Hey, what is up you guys and welcome to this episode of Eddie's Customs and Restorations. Okay, so have you ever gotten into your car or truck and you have an electric choke and everything and you fire it up for the first time in the morning and it just screams. It's just, you know, super loud in the morning and you're so annoyed because you're waking up the neighbors and everything with your super high idle. What that is, that is called your fast idle. That is your initial idle when you first start up your car or truck in the morning or first you know point of the day when you first fire it up now there is a way that you can adjust that if it is too high let's just say it's at 2000 rpm well just like on the other side now this is not the screw that we're talking about just like on the other side you have that idle screw right there well you have the same thing that, that one on that side, that's your, your curb idle. That's your, your idle once your car is warmed up. Now, your fast idle, which is your first initial one, is back here, right behind your choke, right there. Not, not this one. I'm not talking about that one right there. I'm talking about the one back here, right there, okay? Now that one, if you can see, it's got a little flat head on it, but it's also a quarter inch, which is why I have this little guy right here. Okay, that's a quarter inch wrench. Now, you can come in here, you see, and you can grab a hold of that, right? And you can turn it either to the left or to the right. Now, if you turn it to the right, like if you're tightening it, you're gonna make it idle even higher. So what you need to do is you need to turn it to your left, lefty loosey, like if you're loosening it up. So as you're, what you're doing is you're gonna be loosening that screw and it's gonna be getting off of that throttle basically, the throttle plate. Okay, so as you're pulling it out, as you're unscrewing that screw, you're gonna be lowering your fast idle. So turn on your car in the morning and let it scream like it normally does, right? And immediately when it's cold just come over here and start slowly turning it back unscrewing it slowly little quarter turn increments and the moment that it's at the idle that you want leave it alone and that's all you got to do and and the next time you wake up in the morning and you fire it up you're not gonna piss off the neighbors anymore well if you found value in this video please hit that like button so that it lets YouTube know that this is good content and if you like automotive videos hit the subscribe button Thank you very much for watching. Till next time.